This video content is not intended for children. <laughs> Realistic fishing. Thank you, man. Love the channel, by the way. Welcome back to Realistic Fishing. I'm out here this morning to fish for bass with a creature bait. Let's just get started and see if we can catch anything. Let's check out what I'm using. I got a brush hog here with a 1 16th ounce weight. I'm fishing 12 pound test on a bait caster. This is an Abu Garcia Black Max on an All Star T38X. This is an old one from like the late 90s, early 2000s, back when they were still made in the USA. I'm not gonna be casting very far. I'm fishing shallow. I'm gonna be dragging it on the bottom. Just looking for attention. It sort of imitates a worm. It sort of imitates a lizard. It sort of imitates a crawfish. It's a good all around creature bait and that's why it's named such. I thought I'd try over here at the big lake, 20,000 acres. This is just a creek coming off of it. Fish? Oh, I think I had a bite. Anyway, this is just a creek coming off of it. You know, this is probably mm, a 10 acre creek out of 20,000 acres. I mean, these are big creeks. We're talking about a big lake here. Let's get back down there, see if I can find that fish. May have been a warmouth or some other kind of aggressive panfish. Not too sure. I'm seeing the occasional shad flicker out there. It's a good sign that there's life back here. Might have to imitate some shad to get a bite today. I'm not sure. Ugh, bugs. Don't you hate that when it sounds like you got a mosquito or something flying right into your ear? Makes my skin crawl. Captain C.C. Corey here, the North Florida angler, and you're watching Realistic Fishing. Keep it realistic. Oh, I don't know if that was a bite or if I was snagged on something. Let's just get it back down there, see if that fish is still there. If it was a fish. Fish. Got him. All right. Nice little buck bass here. Young buck, right through the top of the nose. Yeah, I thought I was getting a bite and I did. Little quarter pounder, maybe a half pounder at the most. Royale with cheese. Got him on that little creature bait. 16th ounce Texas rig, getting it done in spring.
Good fish. Just kind of pitching it down there alongside the dock. We're going to fish the cover. There we go. I'm not seeing any bedding fish. I'm not seeing any bedding bluegill or bass yet. I think it's still just a tiny bit early, but I'm gonna guess high 50s, low 60s. But we're still getting cold at night, you know. Sometimes down into the high 30s and low 40s. This is Slash Gills from the Juggalo Fishing Posse, and you're watching Realistic Fishing. Keep it realistic. guys since that's the only fish I caught I'm not gonna bore you with a hundred fishless casts instead we're gonna check out an awesome deal I found on underspins at Ollie's I spent a total of $21.74 at Ollie's and in case you're not familiar with Ollie's it's a bargain store outlet store kind of thing and when stores discontinue or have excess stock, they send it to Ollie's and you can buy it for cheap. Let's see what I got, shall we? Well, they're all going to be pretty much the same thing, but here's what I got. I got Wahoo branded Power Stand Up Bucktail Jig. The thing is, with these bucktail jigs, They're actually underspins, right? So this is a Wahoo Power Stand Up Bucktail Underspin Jig. This one here is a Chartreuse Green. Real quick about the jig, it says it has a natural bucktail, epoxy coated thread, slow falling design, and heavy premium hook. $1.99 for an underspin. That's a great deal. And I got a bunch of them, right? Different weights, different colors. Here's a black and silver and red. Here's a white and silver. Can you see it? Another black and silver. Got another chartreuse and silver here. This is a big boy. This is like half ounce, three quarter ounce, maybe. And all of these are underspins, which makes them super cool. Here's white. Another white. Another black and silver. Black and silver. Here's red and white. I bought 10 of them at two bucks each. That's $20 in underspins here. You know, if you go to some stores and buy certain brands of underspin, you're going to pay six, seven, eight dollars each. You'll get two or three for 20. I got 10 for 20. And that's what I like about Ollie's. And you know what? We're going to give some away. I got so many here, there's no way I can use 10 underspins in a season. So, let's do it. We'll give away this black and silver. Chartreuse. And white. We're giving away three underspins today on Realistic Fishing. 
And not only that, I'm gonna go get some swim baits to go on as trailers. I'll be right back. Vance here from Fishing with Vance. You're watching Realistic Fishing. Keep it realistic. All right, to go with the three underspins, we're also gonna give away a package of KVD Perfect Plastic Swim Baits. This is the four inch KVD Swim and Shiner. All you gotta do to be entered to win is like the video, leave a comment, and make sure you're subscribed. And I'll pick the winner in a future video. So good luck to everyone. All right, now we're gonna move on to picking a winner from the last giveaway video. All right, loading up the comments. Looks like we have 343 comments. Let's pick, oh, before I pick the winner, let's see what's up for grabs. This giveaway is for some small hair jigs, go 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 baits, Ned Rigs, some X Zones, Great Lakes, Big Bite Baits, and the Baker Jerk Bait. Good luck to everyone. Let's see who the winner is. The winner is Dennis Renner. He says, nice show today. Thanks, Dennis. You just won all of these baits. What you got to do is send me an email. Realisticfishing at gmail.com. Get me that shipping information and I will get these baits out to you. My name is Dewey Cash, and you're watching Realistic Fishing. Keep it realistic. Good luck to everyone in today's giveaway. Thanks for watching me catch that one single bass on a Texas rig creature bait. And congratulations again to Dennis. And thanks for watching Realistic Fishing. Keep it realistic.